Hi, I'm Joachim for Statistics Globe, and in this video I'll explain how to subset a data frame between two dates using the R programming language. In the video I'm going to show you an example, and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 to 8 of the code. So if you run these lines of code, you can see that a new data frame object appears at the top right of RStudio, which is called data. And we can have a look at this data frame by clicking on the data object. And after clicking on this data object, you can see that a new window is opened, which is showing the structure of our data frame. And as you can see, our data contains six rows and two columns, whereby the first column contains dates and the second column contains numeric values. Now, one important point when we want to subset our data set between a date range is the class of our date column. And we can check the class of our date column as you can see in line 10 of the code. So in this line of code, I'm applying the class function to our date column. And if you run this line of code, you can see at the bottom in the RStudio console that currently our date is formatted as character. However, in order to subset our data frame based on this date column, we need to convert our date to the date class. And we can do that by applying the sdate function, as you can see in line 12 of the code. So in this line of code, I'm applying the sdate function to our date column. And then I'm storing the output of this in the date column once again. So in other words, I'm updating the class of our existing date column to be the date class. If you run line 12 of the code, our data is updated and we can check this by running line 14 again, because in this line of code, we are again checking the class of our date column. And as you can see, after running this line of code, now our date column has the date class. So in the next step of this tutorial, I'm going to subset our data frame based on this date column. And we can do that as you can see in lines 16 and 17 of the code. And in this line of code, I'm specifying the name of our data set. Then I'm opening square brackets. And within the square brackets, I'm using our date class to specify a logical condition. So as you can see in these lines of code, I'm specifying that I want to retain only those dates in our data set, which are larger than the 1st of January 2021 and smaller than the 1st of January 2024. And then I'm storing the output of this in a new data set, which is called data new. So if you run lines 16 and 17 of the code, you can see that another data frame object is appearing at the top right of RStudio, which is called data new. And if you click on this data object, another window is opened, which is showing our data frame subset. And as you can see, our data frame subset contains only three rows instead of six rows because this time we have subsetted the range between the 1st of January 2021 and the 1st of January 2024. So in this tutorial, I have explained how to subset a data frame between two dates using the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. And I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video. Furthermore, if you have liked this video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.